Did you know over 73,000 children in the state of South Carolina have an incarcerated parent? That those children face many challenges growing up. Bicyclist Building Bridges is a group that is on a mission to support them. Andrea Morrison and Bertha Edmond joining me right now to talk about an upcoming fundraiser that they have. Thank y'all so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you, you for having us. You are so welcome. Now, Andrea, let's start with you. You said you founded this organization. Tell us why and some of the challenges that these kids face. Yes. Um, I was locked up myself back in 1992, mm -hmm. and I left behind three young sons, ages two, five, and eight years old. When I came home, they were 13, 16, and 19. So um, they were very broken children when I came home, and I listened to the stories that they told me, and I went to work and found me a good faith-based church, mm -hmm. and life was going really good for me after being home about 11 years. And I had asked God, I said, God, what can I do for you? He said, do for children what you said no one did for your children. My children said if they could have visited me more, it would have made life a whole lot better for them. So I started an organization that could take children four times a year to visit their parents for free. That is amazing. And you're giving back, really helping the kids out there, doing some great work, Andrea. And Bertha, let's get straight to you and talk about what you got, what y'all are doing um, coming up with the fundraiser. What we're doing, we're trying to get kids registered. So if anyone know of any children whose parents are incarcerated and those children can't get out to visit their parents, we're there for them to come on in Sign, get signed up with bicyclists building bridges and we're going to be the ones to work it out where we can take them to see their parents. That's wonderful. And where can someone sign up? Um, this coming Saturday um, at our uh, location is 3601 Meeting Street Road, um, the old Tri-State Building. We're doing a registration um, and a fundraiser because we're trying to raise funds to open our first community center here in Charleston, South Carolina for these children. And um, that day we're going to have um, registration for kids to sign up and we'll start immediately taking them. And I, have, their parents. I have to ask, are the inmates and the kids so appreciative of the yes. thing you're doing? Yes, I yes. Um, yeah. I have, um, we have about 25 children in our program now that we've been taking on a constant basis. We have um, seen their characters change, grow, brighter smiles, um, and they often always tell us how appreciative they are and how those days seeing their parents is the brightest for them. I bet so, and thank you all so much for coming, and we'll of course get all the information that everyone needs to know on our website, countonto.com. Thank you.